said yet more sanctions will be brought in against Russia. Let's get more on this with RT's Alexei Yaroshevsky, who's in New York, standing by to speak to us. Alexei, what do we know about these new sanctions introduced by President Obama, or indeed announced by President Obama, I should say? Yes, it's uh, the latest string of sanctions against Russia, uh, which uh, the U.S. president just announced a short while ago. And we understand that those sanctions are directed particularly at uh, Crimea. Now, according to the new set of sanctions, the U.S. companies will not be able to uh, either export their goods or uh, technologies or well, services no, uh, to the peninsula. Uh, and also, um, uh, President Obama specified that uh, companies and uh, individual businessmen working in Crimea may also be sanctioned uh, according to this new uh, set. Now this follows a string of uh, turnarounds from the U.S. president and the U.S. administration because uh, on Wednesday uh, the uh, U.S. Um, State Department uh, spokesperson Jen Psaki said that the uh, new set of sanctions against Russia would be signed. Then the White House denounced uh, such claims uh, on Thursday when President Obama signed a congressional bill uh, providing help to Ukraine. Uh, he said that he would not actually sign uh, the new set of sanctions against Russia, but now we see uh, that there's another turnaround and another contradictory uh, action from the U.S. President. The new set of sanctions has been signed. We're, of course, uh, waiting to see whether there will be any more reaction and will be any more specific about what particular companies uh, could be affected by that. Explaining the situation from New York for us, Alexei Yaroshevsky, thank you.